what is up? Hell yeah, socks off at the door. That's the only way you can steal them. What's going on, Matt? Hey, Kim. <clears throat> What's going on, Adam? Hey, Ashley. What's going on, Drew? Hey, John. What's going on, Brian? How are you all doing? What's going on, Joe? It's been much for me, man. Just been chilling today. What's going on, Kim number two. What's going on, Whirlpool? Just gonna qualify accounts so I can get some more flappers on them. Although I do need to start playing some of these. I need kingmakers. Might have to start playing some of these pro weekend rounds. I'm playing left dash. Bows are at the top. What? What's going on, Joe? What's going on, Hammers? Thanks for the good luck. Still wearing yours? I mean, you have to, right? What's going on, Jim? Enjoy your streams, Dan. Like, uh, like getting away from reality, watching your streams. Should stream more often. Um, just because it's being dropped from the left. I don't know. Like, I I play it to the right master. I play it the way that it's dropping. All right, here I'm going to do plus 5% mid. I'm going to go 2.5. Half a ball of right curl. And then hopefully we get a decent rollout, but not too far. 344. Cheat. A lot further than I normally play. What's going on, Ingrid? All right, so 344. If 40 was 80%, that's four yards. Four times two is eight. So it should be 80%. we'll find out if this is right ash i i, I just posted a minus 18 um explaining how to do the shot there i mean i can but it's brandon burke shot yo what's going on nico All right, I'm going two backspin. I'm going to aim before the glitch here, and then I'm going to go 3.3 .3 rings. All 
All right, so slider numbers are right. All right, 343 is 80%. Yo, what's going on, Mikey? It was a stream, but you can also check out Brandon Burke. I don't know if someone can link Brandon Burke's channel. What's going on, Carl? Hey, Emily, how you doing? Thank you for the good luck. What's going on, Jim? I'm just trying to make sure I didn't miss anyone. going on david cat hello i don't know if it said hi to you i'm pretty it, it said the title says tournament right or 344 sorry thank you for the correction So I just uh, I'm just uh, putting yardages in as I get them, but I mean, basically go off of like 340 as your base in the notes, and then you should be good. All right, so when we're doing P3 plus 10 percent elevation at mid distance with QBA numbers. What's going on, Glenn? How you doing? Thank you for the good luck. All right, four nine. We're going to go four seven. Ah, oh, man. I don't know why it's this hole that gives me the most difficulty with hitting great. Like, perfect sand every time. Mm-mm. And the reason why I pull back instead of underpowering on these shots is because underpower isn't the same as pulling back. It's inconsistent. It doesn't work the same as overpower. And it slows down your needle, which makes it more difficult to hit perfect. Um, in my opinion. And also, like, when you adjust differently up on a hill... It can throw off your adjustment but that's just me um when i designed this shot when the tournament first came out the redwood cup tournament um it's how i always played it it's how i've always dropped it you just gotta get used to playing it that way yo what's going on numb how you doing what's going on will thank you for the good luck Big Mike, welcome. Thank you for being in here. What's going on, Pixels? How you doing, man? So there actually is a way to avoid having to pull back a ring. So if you actually, um, if you actually pay attention to where you pull back like if, if you pull back right at the start and you pay attention where you're like you're pulling back too you can just line up there every time and not pull back at all what's going on your dads thank you for the good luck Um, 
Um, I do choose to play with a power four ball here because um, I have a lower level sniper. You don't need to, but um, just my choice for this shot. You can play with a kingmaker still. Just if your drive comes up short, you have to push and pull rings from off the hill and it just not fun. Oh, Nico, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you so much for the donation. It really means a lot. Thank you. What's going on, Chris? How you doing? Thank you for being in here. I finally said your name. Thank you, Ingrid. Damn. What's going on, Scott? Thank you for being in here as well. I play this one 15% max distance in my club. What's going on, Jugs? Oh, Mike, thank you so much for the donation and the kind words, bud. Really appreciate it, man. Thank you, thank you. All right, so no matter what level my rock is, I'm always gonna set up at max and then I'm gonna adjust my spin from here. So, the reason why I use the rock is because it has a developed ball guide at an early stage. But your lower level QBs don't. So here I'm going to go 4.8 rings. E4 numbers plus 15 max. And then since I only have two side spin, I'm going to have the left side of the ball touching the outside part of the white ring. And this shot has been great proof for me. And then I think I'm looking for like 322. And then from here, it should be just minus 25% P3 numbers max. What's going on, Tango? How's the new transition going for you? What? What's going on, Brandon? How you doing, man? How's Master going for you, bud? First off, what's going on? 2 a.m. I hate when I can't sleep, man. Thank you for hanging out in here. I really appreciate it. And very awesome round, by the way. Happy for you. What's going on, Scar? I have to learn Spanish. Alright. Did I find the sticky spot on this? I think. I'm going to look for the tail and then minus 25% max P3 numbers. So I'm going to go 4.2. Slide 11.59 flicker. Sometimes shit just feels off. I hate this.
Like, even though I know it's money, it just... It scares the shit out of me. I don't know why. I need to stop giving a fuck. What's going on, Brett? What's going on, Jose? How you doing? What's going on, Kevin? Thank you for being in here. Yeah, I'm qualifying. I don't know if I'm going to play it, though. I'm really just, like, playing to, sh to stream. I really could give a fuck less what I shoot. All right, let's go and check out Brandon Burke real quick because I got to get his shot. I didn't write it down. Um... I just gotta look at where he lines up. What's going on, Neil? Hey, Keith, thank you for the good luck. All right. All four. I'm getting his video some views. If you guys want a money um, whole four set up and you wanna check out some new guides, maybe get a different aspect to the game. Click on that link. Go check out hole number four in the pro division. The same shot that I'm doing now. Show some love to an amazing person. Probably one of the, I, I think the best free to play master player in the game. So it's red touching just as it comes off. Alright. <clears throat> I do P3 plus 15% mid. Um, just how it's been working for me. I gotta go look at this curl reference. What's going on, Lucas? How you doing? one hit the pin and jumped out gotta be careful on your top spin um that's why i like writing down my yardages because then i know i can have like a, a a set spin um depending on the shot that i'm playing so like when i'm using a p4 ball i know i use like 3.5 top from 322 if i'm using a king maker i'd probably use like closer to four because we have less yards if that makes sense but that that tail is really what you're looking for. Yeah, I don't see hole four as being a consistent drop. Hole seven either. Hole seven and hole four have uh well hole four is just shit. And then hole seven's kinda hit or miss for me. Have I heard anything out of Daniel? Um Daniel and I text occasionally. I mean, he's that he's retired, so. I can always see you, Pixels. What do you mean? What's going on, Brett? I gotta update this, but I gotta ask Brandon for his permission because um, I don't just put other people's shots in my guys without asking first. It's not how I roll. What's going on, George? Oh, fuck, man. All right. We got higher wind here. All right, Red. I can't see the difference. You're gonna go right, so you see it hit the tree and come back off. I can't see the difference in the rough line. I'm fucking colorblind. And then here I'm gonna go 6.2.
Turn, 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 turn. Close. Close, close, close. Oh no, I gotta turn that off. I'm not gonna start that shit. I mean, it's a nice shot. It's a, it's a lot closer. Like I've hit it once. I, I just missed it there. Um, I had to rush on my pullback, so I could have done something wrong, but I like it. You know, I'm going to keep playing it. Hole four is kind of, uh, I don't know. It's like a up in the air. If I can hit it 50, 50, I'd be happy. Yeah, this course is going to be up and down. Um, you're going to have good rounds and you're going to have shit rounds. Just how this course is. You just got to take it as it comes. Like my master rounds have been all over the place. It's crazy. I'm, I'm like really afraid to play expert because I've only played one account and I played that account on Monday. I haven't even played another account. What's going on, Raymond? I can see your comments, Pixels. Yeah, I did. It, uh, that was my first go through. I dropped the minus 17. I'm only playing lower level clubs than expert from now on. I feel like R and masters like minus 15. Like masters become my love. Like I'm, I'm getting back into playing master. Um, I'm enjoying working with Wolfpack. So for me, like I'm going to be putting out stuff for, um, expert and pro through opening round. And then I'll probably be, um, I'll probably stream a weekend round. I'm not sure of expert, but probably be more so streaming master on weekends. I'm going to do three right. I'm going to go like. I think I'm going to go like 1.9 back. I'm going to go P3 plus 10 max. I'm going to go 6.1. I'm not going to do any curl. And, uh. I think I'm looking for like 275, This is one of the fewer tournaments that we've had that um you kind of what's going on brendan that you don't need uh higher level clubs I, I think it's it's mainly like redwood you know like you can't do hooks and slices like normal courses which i think is nice so it's more about precision and dialing in i'm doing well brendan how you doing bud All right, Tango, have a good stream, man. All 
All right, so here I'm going to do plus 10% min. I actually push up from min line though. I want to be through, but on top of the cup. And then I'm going to add plus one to the adjustment. So I'm going to go 2.5 rings here. <laughs> I always make it on that low side. <sighs> Shot. Pisses me off. Nice, Tango. Congratulations, man. Proud of you, bud. Yeah, so, Brendan, the only thing, like, I can really tell you is you have to... You have to take what someone else does and you have to make it your own um you can't just read a guide or or look at someone's playthrough and assume that you're gonna do well and i'm not saying that's what you're doing but i think a lot of people do that like a lot of people think that it's it's copy and paste and it's it's not even close to that so um In my opinion, it's not even close to that. Because these same people that complain about guides and complain about people streaming, you know, aren't winning multiple banners or getting gold every tournament. What's going on, Milton? There's pull angles, there's wind differences, like there's so many variables to tournaments that people don't realize. Like someone will make a shot. They'll hit it once and then they'll never hit it again and they won't understand why. Yeah, I think going from a rookie to pro is probably the biggest jump. Probably the biggest jump in the game. That's where you really start learning about that wind effect and where you uh where you need to kind of be paying attention to elevations that can bounces stuff like that don't overthink it stick with it you'll get the hang of it I know Kim. I <laughs> I want I want my Apoc Six. I li literally when you and I played this course together in pro, I was so jealous because you could fucking have a thorn for an albatross. What's going on, Jamie? I've been well, man. Just been staying busy. Just been staying busy. I took a break last week. It was uh, it was relaxing. All right, so I'm gonna have to hit perfect for this to just make it through but like even if I don't make it through I'm gonna be fine and then I'm just gonna set up With like there's this bush right here. I just put my yellow a little bit into the bush And then I just do I'm gonna do plus five p5 numbers max. So I'm gonna go 4.1 And then I'm gonna push back to max Full OP, baby, right, curl. Um, if I had a ball that had less wind resistance, I would probably use it. Um, 
I mean, there's really not much wind you can you can uh you can use, right? On this whole Kim. I mean I don't really know. Thanks, Chris. I really appreciate that, man. Thank you for the kind words. I know that's fucking Todd as well. I just didn't give him the satisfaction. Yeah, but the rock hook is weird though, Kim. Like, I don't know if it would work here. Yeah, I would use that, Brendan, if you can hit it perfect. Like, if you have an APOC 5 here, or like a, a Thor's like six or seven, just blast that shit. If you have a higher level APOC, you can actually get like down to that third pad pretty easily too. How you doing, Alex? I love the rock, but the rock changes so much from a level five to a level nine. <laughs> just like fuck it and land there um i don't even know this is gonna be a guess Hopefully you don't catch that glitch roll. Too much girl. I forgot to bring my um, Goliath. I didn't even pay attention to having my uh, Grizzly in my bag. Oh, thanks, Brendan. I haven't seen it scar did you post it to telegram chats i'll have to uh i'll have to do a video of it i'll give you credit i haven't seen it though yeah alex all is well for me man hopefully same for you yeah i think you need like 7.5 or above uh Christoph. but you should still be able to reach all right i'll have to go look scar I usually don't look at telegram until like Wednesday night Wednesday or Thursday Yeah, telegram is members only Try to get people active in it, man, but Like I don't know. It's weird It's weird It's really hard to get people to post stuff in in like whole chats like I think people are so scared to post even if they like miss a shot um it's probably one of the hardest things to get people to do all right let's try a new theory If my wind is above five, I'm going to do plus 15 max. There's two different wind angles here. There's a severe crosswind and then there's a like tailwind. I think crosswind needs like almost no backspin. <laughs> that was a beautiful score, Carl. Yeah, I know, Scar. That's like one of the reasons why I went to uh why I went to Telegram. Oh fuck. This is a big wind. I like this rough bump. I just don't like adjusting down into the bunker. 
I just feel like there's so many variables to this rough bump. Crazy. Seagar. Thank you for the good luck. Don't know if I said that right. What's going on, Liz? Is the tree in the way? Are they going to give me uh king? Oh, they didn't give me king wind. All right. So what I do is I back off here and I'm pulling down until I get to the plus three. And then I move on this line here. Once I get to this line on my third bounce, I add spin. Two right spin. Like 0.3 back. And then I'm going to do plus 15% max. I'm going to go 3.8. See if I need to add curl if it's too much. No, so it still does need the baby left curl. I thought plus 15 would get it to not need curl, but I'm still going to need it with plus 15. I hate this haul. I'm almost tempted to just use a fucking windfall and all my issues. See, this is like a hole in a tournament that if you hit this hole you are going to win the tournament like this is the end all be all like hole seven i feel like is the end all be all hole seven hole seven and hole four you hit those two you're gonna win the tournament in pro hands down How do I not have my big topper in my bag? That would be a hole where I say pull out a fucking wind ball. Fuck it all. It's like the only time you'll ever see me use a fucking navigator too. I might use a wind ball on my next account. Anyone know how a wind ball plays? Huh? 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 Sounds like you tried the QB power curl on hole eight. No, I have not. I have not. I haven't even seen a QB power hook. I usually don't do those things in my guides because, uh, like, I'll hold on, I'll explain after I take this shot. All right, so I'm gonna go over this middle of this right bush, and then I always check my landing spot. And then from here, I'm going to do P1 plus 10 max. So I'm going to go 
Oh wow, I got stuck. Crazy. That's the only reason why I don't like using all but like, like that's the only reason why I don't like using not full topspin on the big topper. Cause then like you get I don't know, it's hard to explain. So you could push more forward. But then hitting great could be dangerous. I mean, hitting great dangerous any direction is. What level of QB do you use? You would need like a P1 side spin three win five. I think. Eight and ten. I'll have to check it out. I'll have to check it out for sure. Yeah, Carl, I'll post it. I'll try it on my next account. It's the first time that the QB or the big topper has failed me though. I mean, the only thing that sucks about using uh, the big topper is if you hit great, you're screwing. Oh no, what happened? That's not good. Sorry, I'll put the music back on in a minute. Uh, Brendan, if you would like to become a member, um, let me see if I still have this. If you want to become a member, you can click that link on, um, it is much appreciated, but definitely not a requirement for anything. I do really appreciate all the love and support though. All right, now we're going to do a rough bump. I like to use a P4 ball here. Um, you can use, you can use like a Zerk. You don't have to use a P4 or a money ball. You could probably use a Titan too. You would just need more topspin. One of the reasons that I like to use a, a P4 ball is because then I'm using less topspin. So that glitch roll really doesn't come into play. Yo, what's going on, Albie? Not going low on this one. We hit great on two. And then I fooked up um hole eight. But that's this course. It will happen. Just gotta take it where it comes and move on. I'm going to use a half a top here just because I don't have my notes in front of me, but I'm going to do P4 plus 15 max. So I'm going to go six rings. 
no side spin, blue ring on rough at max. Oh, thanks, man. I appreciate it. Thank you for the donation, bud. See if we can get closer on this, uh, this rough bump. It says I haven't, uh, I haven't, that was the first time I've ever hit great on hole two. I don't use, like, I remember Kim had issues hitting perfect on hole two. Um, I don't know. It's really weird. That was, that, I can honestly say that was the first time I ever hit great on hole two. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go 2.5 rings here. Got a really weird rollout last time I did this. Then it comes in too high, so weird. So last time I came in like really far to the right and short, and then this time, this time I came in high. Another time I came in perfect, just like on the low side of the cup. Weird. <laughs> you still hit great, Kim. I'm probably going to now. Like, I'm probably going to start missing it next, but just because I said something to you. No, I don't. I fell off. Like when I even when I first started, I felt like my perfect should have been great. When have you ever heard anyone say that? When have you ever heard someone say that their perfect should have been great? First time in history you ever will hear a streamer say that. Yeah, like I just I felt I feel so off right now. I don't know what it is. You always hear people complaining about hitting great. I'm complaining about hitting perfect. All right, so shot of 15. It's not great, but it's going to happen for sure. We can't miss eight. That was a dumb dumb. And then we hit great on two. Seven. I'm going to, if I have wind balls, I'm going to try and dial in a wind ball shot. I don't have a problem with you. You, you mean you want me to adjust incorrectly so I can make a great shot? I can tell you all right now, if I don't hit certain things on this account, I'm not, fin I'm not qualifying it. This account is going to get my full attention.
going on Davik? Wait, hold on. I've had that it released and immediately go fuck in my head and see it says perfect somehow. Yeah. So like whenever you do something, whether it's golf class related, it's, it's real golf or work or something that you do like repeatedly on a day to day basis, right? Like you have timing, you have muscle memory and you can, you can honestly just feel when you're off just how it is. All right, six zero plus five mid, and we're gonna go three point three. So if I miss any, like if I miss one, two, or three, um, I'll be just going to my expert account. Then we start off with a great. I think we need to add 2% to slider hitting great right. But 334, we're going to be at max. Telegram is an app. All right, Scar, have a good one. He, is Keith going to train you? Is Keith taking you under under his wing? Keith, I didn't know you were offering uh training purposes. All right, we're going to set up plus 25% and then we're going to see where we are in our club. I'm going to base it off plus three. All right, I'm still going to just do max since we're at plus two so i'm gonna see how this works so we're gonna go So great, right? This is why I use plus yards as a reference and I don't use yardages like I don't know man, I would like something about uh, yardages on on guides and stuff like pisses me off Because if you hit great right or left or even have like a higher win than normal like it will kick you one way over another and sometimes yardages don't always work I would rather reference plus yards than yardages, but that's just me. 
Everyone's different. Sometimes yardages work. Sometimes they don't. What are you charging nowadays, Keith? You, you charging like a, a full ball pack now? All right. I'm going to start with the sail ball because it has perfect spin. And then I'm going to see um, what it sets me up at as far as wind is concerned. Because if I had a choice in perfect wind for this shot, it would be around five miles per hour. And this is like my baby account, so I will use paid balls in this account. I mean, you are, you you bought some balls today, Pixels. Still disappointed you didn't uh you didn't buy the hundred dollar pack. I felt like you would have got some Apox in the hundred dollar pack. I have pulled back too much there. No, we good. We good. We good. All right, we got the start that we wanted. Three should be money, but hopefully I don't jinx myself. I gotta see if I have a uh, <laughs> I gotta see if I have those balls those p4 side spin two or three balls in this account I wish Henry was in here Henry I think Henry has a whole seven dialed in pro Anyone page Henry? Henry! Also, if you all are looking for some awesome expert content, you can click this link and you can get a minus 18 walkthrough featuring Kime. Go show her video some love. I heard if you watch that video, you get extra luck on the weekend rounds. Just what I heard though. All right, let's see what kind of balls I have on this account. I don't have the P4. I'm going to buy a pack of these new balls. Just give me a second. Give me one minute.
Oh shit. Alex went there. Alex went there. Alex is throwing in the dagger. Normally I don't like buying balls this way, but I'm just gonna buy the I'm just gonna buy the five dollar pack. <laughs> oh it is brian see like this is so we gotta understand right like people buy balls people want to know how to use them you know what i mean like so many streamers like don't use paid balls in lower divisions but there's people that that ask for it that was one of the things that kind of grew my channel, to be honest, was uh, was uh, actually using paid balls in lower divisions. I mean, if you're a new streamer, I would recommend if you can, if you can afford it and you use special balls anyways, don't be afraid to use them. There are people out there that need help with paid balls. So many people talk down on it that it makes people scared. Fuck them. Fuck what people think. All right, plus 15 P4 max. We're going like hitting great left it's gonna set me up in a different spot but we'll see if this adjustment is still money what's going on max how you doing Exactly, Alex. Exactly. How are you doing, by the way? <laughs> What's going on, Shay? <laughs> See, Matt, sorta. All right. I'm gonna find the sticky spot. We'll look for the tail and then we're just gonna pray on this one so i'm gonna go It's going to be close. Dead nut. Depends I posted three shots on my drive on hole eight. One time I got greedy trying to go far right and hit great right, but still left a short chip. You have any QB eights on that? Any QB eights in those playthroughs?
Nice, Alex. Nice, nice, nice. Take it easy, though. I'm just gonna check my pin chest here. Then we're gonna get a kingmaker. I'm gonna remove one of these because we're gonna make this, right? I mean, I, okay, so like Carl, you gotta understand there's there's a difference from a QB level eight to a nine, okay? There's a four yard difference. It all makes the difference. I wanna see i'm technical man i want to see how you're you're how close you're getting to things i want to see what you're doing different with a different level qb i'm technical with shit. you should know that by now i like the rock setup i just haven't put it in the guides up ryan um i needed to get guides out I just didn't put it in. But I like the rock setup. I mean, Kim, whatever Kim posted in hers, I would I would go watch it. I think we both have setups, but I think she has more of a setup that gets you the hole in one. My walkthrough is just based on Monday. I mean, it's going to get you a safe eagle. But if you want to get greedy, get greedy. Hole eight, Kim. Yeah, but she just put out a walkthrough, Ryan. Go watch his walkthrough. Go check it out. Hole eight. And satisfy all your dreams and imaginations. What's going on, JB? How you doing, man? Mania, welcome in here. Takashi69, welcome. Hopefully your uh, security is holding up well for you. All right, 15 mid. Wow, why am I getting a bullshit win? Literally getting like. might even go a little bit more like i'm gonna go Love you, Brandon Burke. You're a genius, my friend. It is Alex, but it's a money shot. get that bad boy in there Henry what's going on G King I need you Henry are you playing pro Alex 
<laughs> oh carl thank you so much for the donation man what's going on caleb how you doing henry hole seven your wind ball approach what are you doing what's your adjustment i'm gonna use the wind ball on hole seven bro i need you i know you're that wind ball guy Yeah, I would recommend if, if uh, for pro I'd recommend watching Brandon. Um, I've hit it. Uh, I've hit it more than I missed so far. All right, and then we're just going to go P3 plus 10 max any level rocks. So we're going to go six rings. doing like 1.9 backspin I basically just need spin setups Henry all right 277 I might aim a little bit higher on the, the you know the top of the hole I'm not sure though like I, I don't want to mess with something that's going in but it's getting like butt pucker scary dropping it on the left side like the ball literally sits on the lip and just decides if it wants to go in the cup or not it's not it's not cool uh john did you ask a question i'm sorry but i'll answer it in a second Oh, don't go short. Don't go short. Yes. I'm talking about get this shit dial, baby. Caddy, but I thought Caddy was playing pro. Just past the cup mid plus 10 using can you send me a replay Henry do you ha do you have one off the top of your uh your messenger I think caddy's asleep caddy's a twunt he's my twunt though I love caddy caddy's probably the nicest human being you'll ever talk to now I don't know what I want to do here. I'm not doing a, a EM hook for right now. Um, like I'm just gonna have to suck it up and just do what I've been doing. And just if I have to, I'm just gonna take my eagle and run. I'm a visual type of guy. Uh, actually, hold on. Let me answer. Um, let me answer John's question. Question to all. Waiting, waiting to level up Spitfire, but I have a Houdini nine and a Malibu nine. Which would you put in your bag? I'll answer that question for you right now, Ben. Let me go to golfclashnotebook.io. Also, I was randomly banned off a of golf clash notebook. So we have 112 yards on the Houdini with a 90% accuracy, but your ball guide is 4.7. Do 
you have decent top spin decent backspin although i've never really seen anyone use backspin out of a bunker malibu you get 109 100 accuracy 30 top spin so my opinion to you if it matters i would play with the houdini because you get more yardage you get more top spin you have an awesome ball guide and like normally i would say pick the club that has the most accuracy but here's why here's the only time i care about accuracy like if you're hitting great you should miss your shot i don't care what club you're using um unless you're in a funnel situation like there was a hole where we were personally driving into a bunker to set up for a funnel in that situation i would use like if it's a funnel situation i would use your accuracy because then if you hit a slight grade it should still go in because the funnel's a funnel that is my opinion what's going on jordan how you doing orlando welcome of course anytime bud anytime But usually for like tour play, you Spitfire six plus. I do just commentate, Brian. That's my secret. That's my secret. Caddy flies here every tournament week he flies to wisconsin to uh play my rounds while i just commentate on my mic he flies from the uk to come and play my rounds All right, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to make this over, but I know I'll still be able to reach. So let's go four rings here. This is more of just a tailwind though, so you should be okay with slight grates. One, two, three. amongst other things that have been said about me you have to like to see now this oh my grizzly shit on this account anyways it wouldn't have mattered do you have to do you have to like finish work um thank you alex i'll make sure to tell him what's going on roy Yeah, I know, Brian. Like, every everyone says that Daniel won my gold master banners, even though him and I both streamed live together. <laughs> like, it's, it's a, the, the people that, the, the shit that comes out of people's mouths is, like, ridiculous. I, like, I've shot in a minus 35. I've shot in a minus 20 front nine and master on stream. I've shot a minus 37 on stream and master. You're just, you're just never going to please anyone. This shit's funny. All right. I think I'm going to go. I'm going to try going 80% slider. I'm going to go 4.7. Some people have said it, Alex. Sorry. 
sorry some 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 what's going on john steve thank you so much for becoming a member bud are renewing to be a member i really appreciate it bud thank you so much some love in the chat for steve please all right thank you henry i appreciate it i'm gonna take a look at it before i start my whole seven i'm getting close like if i can get that little rollout um i i feel like i can drop this so from the plus four i'm playing plus 10 at 80 percent slider p5 numbers it's just hard to judge your uh it's just hard to judge your backspin without a ball guide like if i had a grizzly i'd be dropping that shit every time oh he woke you up my bad my bad What's going on morris how you doing bud thank you for being in here awesome rounds and expert by the way all right let's go on messenger and let's watch this henry shot so mid mid with the wind balls basically just one to one right Blocked in there. All right, where are you setting up, bro? You're in that butt pucker, uh, line up. How are your grades looking? And there's a fucking tree in your way too. Yeah, it's basically one to one. I'm going to try adding a little bit more top Henry. What's going on smart kids? I'm going to add, I'm going to try adding a little bit more top and not getting so close. Cause if I somehow hit the G word, um, I don't want to go flying. What's going on, Sean? G. I don't think I pulled my full four rings. I'm just gonna come up short. Damn right. I don't know how I, I should have kept the ball guy going well through the hole. I don't know why I didn't. That was the first time I've ever tried the rough bump. 
what's new on uh format i don't know if i can if i can show it on stream Let me see if I can add a window capture. Well, that's not right. All right, so um, I don't know if y'all can see, but here is the new formats for uh, notes that are going to be coming out. I mean, they're already out for expert, but they're going to be out for pro starting next tournament. So as you can see, what we're doing different here is if there's a key point in a shot, like a part three, or if there's going to be um, like a second shot um, here, we need to pull back one ring um on hole number two an expert so what i did was i made a small video highlighting that you need to pull back and also i'm pointing out wind angles here so this is what my wind angle looks like when i'm pulling my rings back so you can see the flicker that i'm using instead of me just saying it you can actually see how my arrow is flickering when i'm pulling my rings and then if I'm referencing like a sticky spot, I can show you where I'm finding the sticky spot. Um, also same here as well. Hole five, I think is pretty cool because the thing about hole five in this video, it shows a false ball guide when you add, um, when you add some spin initially. So what I'm showing you here is that when you add like three top spin, you get a false ball guide and you'll see it come up right now. And then when you add more top spin, you get a true ball guide. So just diff a different way, something that I thought of. I think it's pretty cool. Um, I think it might help, especially when the wind changes. So what's going on, Jonathan? How you doing, bro? But yeah. What's going on, Michael Manson? How you doing, bud? What's going on, Steven? Thank you for being in here. Nice, bud. Nice. I'm, uh, I'm looking forward to the new wind changes. Um, I, I don't mind it at all, in all honesty. All right. I think I'm going to go with the big topper here. Um, why do I have, oh, this is expert. I was like, why am I using a Thor six in pro? I'm going to, I'm going to go with the big topper here just because if I mess up, I want to blame myself and not someone else. I don't know what I want to do. I think I might just use a Kingmaker. I think it's going to be funny when they change the wind though. I really do. I really think that a lot of people are going to be uh, in for a rude awakening. One thing that I've always said to people when they message me asking a question about what I think, um, what, what I think about the wind changes is that people want it more like tour play, right? 
But my thing about tour play is you're trying to get closest to the pin and tournaments are trying to get it in the hole. So having a format where you're trying to get closest to the pin isn't going to help you. Just, just my two cents, but. I have other accounts that I'm going to play. So I'm going to um, try the hook shot on a different account. I just want to try and keep my score going. I need to check my bounce. There we go. I just think I was too far back. Like taking off that top spin sucks. Shouldn't have done it. Oh, I'm still going to make guides, bro. Trust me. I will still be making guides. That's not going to stop me. If people are like getting happy because they think that streamers are going to stop making guides i mean it, it, it's just going to make people like tune into youtubers even more right because they're going to want to check out shots before other like before they play so pe people are just going to turn turn tune into streamers even more so if you're, you're getting pissed that people are going to streamers for some advice or to learn i mean you're going to get even more pissed <laughs> like I don't I don't think people truly think things through. I, I really don't. So if you're not a streamer for Golf Clash, I would recommend starting up a channel. Like people's mindsets just blow me, blow me out of this world. And I'm not that's I'm, that's not talking about you who made the comment about guides. That's just people that think that guides are going to come to an end. Yeah, I mean, I already wake up at 2 a.m. Um, to do guides for pro. On, like I won't be doing walkthroughs anymore but I'll still be doing guides I'll still be doing live streams I'll I, I might start posting breakdown videos from opening to weekend rounds I think the only thing that's going to change for me is that I won't be doing walkthroughs What's going on, John boy? Anyone enter my bracket? No. All right, let's see if we can get this 19. Man, if I could just fucking hit seven. Um, I guess I'll just use this ball because I don't have any other P4s. Such a cute doggo. I don't know, man, like. It, honestly, so when I first started playing, I, I started watching Tommy. Um, 
was more interested in streamers that could provide me knowledge um one thing that tommy taught me is about yardages um Uh, when I saw that, like it, it made me want to play golf clash more, but thanks for the good luck, John. Um, when, like when you start understanding something, whether it's like a job or, um, you know, like a sport or maybe if you're like understanding a book that you're reading, you, it makes you want to like get into it more. Right. So I don't. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I, I think people dropping knowledge for others makes the game more fun, which in turn makes them want to keep opening up the game, which in turn keeps golf clash going. Like, why would you want to play something and, and not understand it or maybe not be good at it? Like, I don't, and that I never understood that like philosophy. All right, plus 15 P4 max. They're going to go 6-6. Six, six. I'm only here for the Chris Top comments. I, I mean, honestly, I go into chats and they see the shit that you say and it just cracks me up. Like, so on the, on the topic of like my guides, so like you see me do a lot of writing in my guides. Like I do that because I want you to understand why I'm doing something. I just don't want you to use my guides. I want you to understand why. So at some point on a Monday, you can just say, I'm going to go in and try and figure this out on my own. You know, like I, I want there to be a means to an end to understand what you're doing. This one's weird. I mean, I don't know if I ever drop the albatross in here. I'm just going to say it's luck. If I had a higher level sniper. Might get closer. I don't know. This one's such an up in there shot. Greg, thank you so much for the donation, man. I really appreciate it. That's what you got to do, Sean. Going on JKZ. That's what you got to do, Sean. The more you get pissed off, the worse you play. That's why I just get on and have fun now. I don't, I used to care about what I shot. Like I, I used to feel like I had to, uh, shoot better than everyone else. Now I just don't care if I play well, I play well. If I play like shit, I play like shit. Just because someone shoots a bad score doesn't mean they don't know what they're talking about. And I feel like that's something that like, um, that's, that's something that a lot of streamers, especially new streamers, streamers struggle with. Like they think because they aren't playing well that they, they shouldn't stream or if someone's doing better and that's not the case. There you go, John. 
Yeah, Steve, I agree, man. Like, I, I don't think there should be... Like, if you're going to do ranked brackets, then you need to... uh You need to up the prizes. In my opinion, but... Um, yeah, so we shot another minus 18. Uh, I need to hit seven more consistent. All right, everyone, I'm going to play expert, but I just want to warn you. Okay. I haven't touched. I've played one account in expert. I haven't touched expert since Monday. So this could be ugly. I might not even make the week or an, I might not even make opening. So uh, like I said, I don't care because the less accounts that I have to play, the better. Um, but I'm just, I'm just warning you, this could be ugly. Thanks, John. Appreciate it. I already know I'm going to miss hole two because of Kim. Thanks, Ray. Thanks, Russ, man. I appreciate that, man. I really do. I try to beat up every division I play. Um, <laughs> like a lot of people just think like I'm a beast and pro. I don't have like. I don't know. I mean, it's nice being known to be good at something, but it's also weird. Also weird. It's like I have like I have a uh... Kim. I, I think I I read that wrong first at two Kim. <laughs> it wasn't a bad comment. Sorry about that, Roy. Like I, I have like 40 to 45 top three medals and expert, but all right, let me look at my notes. E3 plus 10 mid. And then I'm going to bring my Grizzly. Cause that's what we want to set up for. And what do I need to qualify? Oh, we should be good. If I can't shoot a, if I can't shoot at least a 12, I think something's wrong with me. What's going on Miller? Thank you for the good luck. Thank you for being in here. Yeah, go sub to uh, Jake Easy. Show him some love. Show all new streamers some love and some support. Glad to hear that there's a new streamer on board. What's going on, Brandon? How you doing, bud? Been dropping your whole four shot in pro. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. If you all haven't clicked the link to sub to Jake Easy, please do so. 
a simple sub getting someone to 50 subs or even 100 subs or even 25 subs can make someone's day brighter it takes you two seconds to click on that link and hit a subscribe button did i get your message Yeah, Brian. Yeah, I can give him away tonight, man. Not a problem. Is it is it okay if I I give it to someone that I feel like deserves it? Is that okay? Or or do you want me to do like a random giveaway? Oh no, is my Thor's hammer? Okay. Oh man, I almost used the wrong bag. Alright, so we're gonna go 4.2. What's my curl? Half a ball, right, curl? I should have let it swing another pass. I'm looking for like 330, 331, so we might be at min long iron. What is this plane? Minus 25 or plus 25. Thanks everyone. Like I like I don't so I don't know. I've never been to Jake Easy's channel, so I don't know. I, I don't know if it's all golf class. Golf class or what, but I usually like to check before I shout someone out just to make sure it's not anything crazy. But I'm assuming since Liz posts the link, I trust her. Ingrid, are you in here? All right, so I did what the notes say. I did minus 0 0.1. Did I say minus 0.1 in the notes? Yeah, I did. Did minus 0 0.1 and we dropped it. Um, I was gonna have, uh, is Ian doing a member stream right now? Oh, he did earlier. Okay. I was going to give Ingrid the socks. I was wondering if she was in here. Ian and I were supposed to stream today, but I was sleeping. Um, I, 
I like I I was I wasn't feeling well, so I took a I took a nap. And then he had messaged me with him working and then the shit that I'm doing, we just haven't been able to connect like we used to be able to. I feel bad. But at the same time, there's really nothing we can both do. We both have lives. You want the used socks? I gotta get weird. Six three, we're going six six. No, I knew when I like I got really nervous because I had to pick my ball. So when I was pulling, I had too much. Um, I pulled too much to the left. I noticed it. I was hoping it wouldn't matter. That was my fault. I panicked for no reason. That was that was on me. That has nothing to do uh, with you. I feel like my pull angle was off Alex. I, I mean, I don't I don't think I pulled crooked I Knew I was gonna miss when Kim arrived I had plenty of time too. I didn't need to uh, rush anything. Yo, what's going on, Gena? All right. Let's see if we can drop three. glad I got one though I was really nervous about I like I'm I'm still nervous about this round even though I shouldn't be I don't know why Ingrid I'm giving you a pair of socks Brian didn't want his socks so I'm giving them to you. Ah, uh, jailbreak. Jailbreak is how you get grid lines. How are level seven epics possible when your common clubs are max? Um.
Hold on. I'll answer that in a second. All right, we're going to go max left, one top. Set up at the max line, and our yellow is going to be just off here. And then we're going to go plus 10 max. So we're going to go 9.2. Curl happily inside the white circle to the left. And then we should be around 322. And then this should set up. So like people are making this at all different um, elevations for the second shot. I mean, it, it's almost straight tail. I really think it doesn't matter depending on the top spin, I think is the most important. You can use minus 10. I see people doing zero, minus 30, 35, 40, 58. It's ridiculous numbers. All right. I'm doing minus 20, though. Now find this sticky spot. We're going to wiggle it. And then. I'm looking for that tail. We always, we always be looking for that tail. And then I'm going to go minus 20 max. So I'm going to go 6.9. Light 11.59 flicker. And see if it drops. This looks like a weird angle. Ah, man, why can't it just be the same every time? Yeah, man, big shout out to Puff Caddy for uh, doing our our new team logo. Our Shade Shot team logo. So if you look at the notes here, we got the logo up at the top. So if you have logo needs, um, I think there's like what a hundred and some odd people in here. Go check them out. Does incredible work. He did that in like five minutes. Go check them out. Send you the logo. I'll send. Can you send me a message to remind me, Kim? I forgot to add it to the stream. All right, I'm going to do the shot that's in the notes, but I think we have a shot that um, our shot team's been hitting. I just have to update it. Uh, so I'm going to try this. So basically what I want with this shot is I would like to have a wind under eight miles per hour so that I can just do a one polar. Um, so I might switch to a season 20 ball. Do I have a link where you can become a member? Yeah, but I just don't post it around much because I, I don't expect people to become members. Um, but if you want to become a member, I greatly appreciate it. And you can click the link there. <laughs> Alex ain't playing tonight. I 
If you get a gold banner in a weekend round, the common to rare epic cards ratio and the prize chest one one to one. So if you win every tournament, you can get a level eight max epics. I, I don't and fuck tournaments in their chest. I mean, in master, I've been getting some decent chests, right? But fuck expert chests. It is such bullshit. They want to say it's random. You randomly give me the same shitty cards every time I win an expert. That shit ain't random. That's bullshit. Play Demic, if you're watching, whoever's in charge of handing out prize chests at the end of a tournament can go fuck themselves. Sorry if there's any kids watching. I don't even think this is set up. Oh, damn. Did I do max side spin on this ball? Oh, this is going to miss. I did four side spin, didn't I? How does it stay up on the hill? I did four side spin like an idiot. Why is that even a thing? <laughs> Why is it even a thing? That's so dumb. I normally don't buy those stupid balls, but I didn't have any centurions on this account. So I bought a $20 pack. Uh, well, that completely throws the shot off having spin and then doing the same curl. This is my dumbass ball for using a wind four ball should have just used the kingmaker and you have this dumb putt it is jailbreaking your ipad if it gets brought up again you're going to be timed out and hidden on the channel if you haven't heard about jailbreaking in 2020, um, I don't really know what to tell you, but I've said it like three times already this stream and you have been the one to ask it twice. Mike, thank you so much for becoming a member, man. I really appreciate it. Some love in the chat for big Mike. This is a one and final warning for you. Fuck you, Dylan. Thank you, Liz or Ingrid. Sorry. Thank you. I can't time out, Dylan. I can't time out <laughs> unfortunately Dylan and I have uh have uh pre-arranged agreements Sarah what's going on sorry god I always fuck up your name always fuck up your name Yo, Puff, thank you so much for becoming a member, man. Get some love in the chat for Puff Caddy.
all right greg have a good one thank you for hanging out man i really appreciate it dylan dylan keeps me uh keeps me level-headed no i'm not gonna time you out not gonna time you out I don't know. I'll let Dylan put a price on his head. Dylan can uh, put a price on his head. All right, I'm going to go one and a half back, three right. Blue just off. I want to be more left on this drive. There's really not much to reference here. And then I'm just going to go plus 10% max. So I'm going to go 10 rings. And then from here, I just like to use like baby overpower over underpowering this because we do have a headwind. You guys are asking me to time out like the wrong people. And then we'll see if we can make this shot. Dylan does have the sexiest mullet known to man. What's going on, Desiree? <laughs> I mean, Mike eats up. So <laughs> you can't say that in this chat, Mike. Oh no, I can't do this shot on this account. Well, I mean, I can, but I had to move up. Shit. All right, so I did plus 25 at 15% slider with the sniper nine. Sniper nine played a little bit different. I had to move up, but the shot is still money. So I don't know how I'm going to incorporate that into the guides. Um, I gotta thank Kim A for that shot. I gotta figure out how I gotta put that in the guide. Cause yeah, I don't know. He'll figure something out. I mean, there is a clear line. But I gotta figure out how to explain it without like I I I, I gotta explain it like I can't say what I want to say without sounding like a dick, so I'm just not gonna say it. Horizon's money.
I gotta explain it in a way where I don't get a hundred messages. So like, I, I there there was a streamer that made a comment that said that my guides are too quote unquote wordy. Okay. But what this person doesn't understand is I make my guys, my guides wordy so that I don't get questions. When you have over 50 to a hundred messages a day, you kind of do things to like cut that in half. I, I've I've learned my lesson. That's 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 what I will say. I've I've learned my lesson. I should like go on stream and like scroll down my messenger one time after tournament week. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Alright, this is just a simple setup. Um, full right spin. I'm gonna go like point two top. And then I aim in the center of this, this fucking tree at max. And then I do full OP, full right cor curl. Try to do full slice. All right, this is the perfect drive, I think, because now I'm not going to have that big ass tree in the way on the left that Kim and I didn't notice. I've just learned my lesson. I love interacting with people, right? I, I love messaging people. I love talking to people. Um, but sometimes I, d I don't like being on my phone, you know, like I'm constantly like, so for Monday, I start at two in the morning and I'm looking at a screen right away when tournament starts, I t it takes like three to four hours to get all my videos for pro. I have to edit my screen while I'm editing and waiting for my video to render. I'm working on notes. As soon as my video is up, I'm done working on notes. Then I have to go into expert. And then I have to uh, go into master. Um, this past Monday I had to work, so I was looking at a handheld all night. Like, like I'm constantly looking at a screen, and it just sometimes you just need to get away from it. Yeah, there's a tree there. a little bit of a sticky spot here, eh? Wait, what's in my way? First and foremost, that fucking bush. I swear, if I hit that bush. Oh, that was close. No, it wasn't the tree this time. <laughs> it wasn't the tree this time, but I, I actually like that bounce over better than uh, landing down. There's like a little groove there. So I did plus 20% at 80% slider from 337. Um, I wonder, I wonder if we do plus 25 from there. But that, like, if it's not a tree, it's a bush that gets in the way.
my mouse died oh one second i gotta grab my cord i like my mouse for my computer i don't have a mouse that died I was playing down low. I wasn't playing uh, up there. That was the first time that I had to play back. Why are you going to say that shit before I play it, Kim? I don't know what I want to do here either because... I don't know if I want I think I want to play Jeff's shot. I got to go look in the expert chat. You guys give me a second. I want to try something. I want to see if I can find it. Who do I have blocked in this group? weird i have someone blocked in uh in one of my chats i don't know why Did someone hacked my facebook Yeah, it's just flickering over. All right. I don't know if I have any of those balls in my account. No, it's not David. I had blocked him this morning. I hit the tree on Monday and I didn't know it was there. I just don't know who I have blocked in this group. Like I'm looking at everyone in the group. I wouldn't have anyone blocked. It's weird. What's going on PewDiePie? Um, the expert chat. Weird. Yeah, man, my iPhone is the worst autocorrect ever. Like, even when I spell something correctly, it will just randomly pick another word. So it's bullshit. I've just given up. I 
No, it's not you, Holmgren. What if I go to... Great. Perfect was then. Maybe it's just on my computer. I don't know who I would have blocked. I did P2 plus 15% mid, three right spin, um, one back spin, set up at min line, all like, um, I was looking for on that pole was I was looking for, um, the right side, like a slight uh, flicker to the right of the middle line, the middle wind line. Um, it's like one to one plus point one or point two. All right, now I'm gonna decide what I want to do here. I gotta see how much backspin I have on this club. I should have enough. Are you guys doing full OP on this shot, Kim? What's going on, Jaime? May? Pole eight with the rock. What's going on, Pradeep? OP, okay. Thanks, hi, mate. When are you going to do a party stream for us, man? When are you going to open up that Discord and let us chat with you? I'm gonna go off a little bit because Got a little bit 
more headwind than anything so i'm gonna take off a little bit of backspin oh my goodness that wow <laughs> the fact that this is even on the green just blows my mind I like I I can't <laughs> I can't even I, I can't even justify why that just happened I can't remember the last time I hit good left or good right on any shot Oh shit, Jaime. when you say some shit like that <laughs> oh my god that is that's fucking epic <laughs> Alright, so I, I just adjusted plus 5% max. And I think they set up a little bit closer with like the blue ring touching the rough at full extension. I didn't because I, I don't know. I just, I just didn't, but I'm glad I didn't because I hit good left. Good left, not so good. If you're afraid of hitting good left with full OP, I would recommend setting up a little bit further away. At least we know it's good left proof though. That was, that was ugly. All right, Thor's hammer. I'm going to try a relic. If a relic doesn't have the wind I want, then I'm going to go with the uh, Zerker type ball. Kind of scared to hit this shot, though, after I just hit good. Going on, KDB. Uh, it depends on what my wind is. So if I have like a nine wind with a relic ball, I'm going to stick with that. Um, if not, I'll switch down to a wind two if I had it. And then if, uh, I don't have wind two, I would just play with the Zerk. All right. So we're going to see if we can clear with this wind i think we have the more tailwind so if i don't drop to like plus 13 here i might switch all right so we went to the plus 12 so we should be good I mean, even if we get the more tailwind, that's all we're looking for. There's a more cross and then there's a more tail. I 
I just don't want to clip if at all possible. So I think like the plus 14 with a Thor 7 is probably your cutoff line. I, I would think like plus 13 is a might be a minimum for a Thor 6 because you don't have as much top spin. It's just, it's super duper scary. Cause I clipped with a Thor 7 on my Sam Jr. account. Yeah, I think I stayed at like plus 15 and I still clipped even with the perfect. All right. So if that was 85, I'm just going to guess because I got it like that. Thoughts on Damien GC? What do you mean? Damien's a beast, man. There's nothing wrong with Damien. I'd recommend uh, going to watch him as another option. I recommend all uh, all streamers. Every streamer. So I did seventy percent slider there. I probably should have went more like around mid or like 60%, maybe 55. Yeah, he's a really good dude. He puts a lot of work into the game. Puts a lot of work into the game. I would recommend uh, watching all streamers like I'm not an end all be all like I don't I don't tell you that you have to just watch my channel like Damien GC um, you have Kim a uh, you have Peter Johnson arguably some of the best expert content in the game uh, you have golf clash Tommy you have GC Matt you have Jaime who doesn't stream anymore, but he puts out some videos. You got Katie B. Oh, you got Jay Keezy, a new streamer. Liz streams. You got all sorts of streamers. You have to find the person that speaks to you. And you will never hear me like tell you not to go watch a streamer for information. Even if I don't like you, I don't mind people going to watch your channel i'll tell you to become a member of peter johnson kim a um on my stream i i don't care i'm not trying to like i'm not trying to keep secrets from people and make you only subscribe to me you got tony richardson it was just a weird question pewdiepie it's a weird question host to golf class you have matthew warren um who else do we have i have a bunch of people subscribed to my channel you have attic tv chris he doesn't play golf clash anymore but he's a good person you got tango you got ian you got neo you got Iceman. uh you got daniel mccarthy even though he doesn't stream anymore you got todd jacks rj tv angles dan t dog miles stick gaming gc joel new streamer you got dale uh, BK Golf Clash, probably one of the nicest people you ever meet. 
Brandon Burke, Santos, uh, GC Radu, Jared A. So many links that it would like, we just have to like start a stream and just talk about all these streamers. You got Brandon Davis, um, probably the most underrated uh, streamer out there. Kills T12. Uh, kills T12, kills master. Awesome dude, very chill, relaxed. Can I unban Tay? I think he just needs to be invited back. All right, but we we hit great on seven, and then we need to hit two. But I mean, I'm not unhappy with a minus sixteen. It was my second look, so not unhappy at all. Not unhappy at all. But with that being said, I am gonna get off. Um, hopefully this content helps you. I really appreciate y'all being here. Um, this will probably be how it's going to be from now on with my schedule because Monday and Tuesdays I'm working on guides and then I'm working on, uh, qualifying my master accounts. And then, you know, if I have work, uh, this is just how it's going to be. So hopefully that's okay with everyone. Um, yeah so i'll be streaming tomorrow or friday i'll be doing a pro and an expert and then on the weekend i'll be streaming master on sunday i'll probably do one or two accounts so have a wonderful night everyone subscribe to all these wonderful people thank you all so much for the love and support and have a wonderful night stay safe everyone peace